only on Wink, a courtroom outburst forces bailiffs to scramble as an accused murderer spits in his own lawyer's face. Deputies say 19-year-old Clinton Drake killed his 84-year-old grandfather in December, but today a judge declared he is not competent to stand trial. Erin Maloney was the only reporter in the courtroom. She's live at four outside the courthouse with the exclusive story. Yeah, there was far more security in the courtroom today than usual, but as Clinton Drake walked into that courtroom, no one was expecting what you're about to see. Drake dressed in a suicide vest was heavily guarded as he faced a judge in a Lee County court, but no one could stop the 19-year-old from yelling. You're all run by the New World Order. His lawyer tried to calm him down before his next outburst. You're all run by the New World Order. You're all run by Google. His lawyer comforted him, telling him he's doing a good job. Then this. <gasps> After the shocking outburst, the judge went ahead with his hearing without him. Drake's lawyer, Beatrice Takachow, returned to tell the court two doctors don't believe he is fit to stand trial. And for the last several weeks, Clinton has been housed in the west side of the suicide section. They have an east and west. He is the inmate there. She says the padded room he was provided wasn't safe enough after he tried to hurt himself by diving into a toilet. The teen has been housed there since deputies say he killed his 84-year-old grandfather and left his body in a truck at a busy Cape Coral intersection. The judge agreed with the teen's doctors. Your opinion that he is incompetent, <coughs> excuse me, to stay in trial, at least at this time. Drake will be treated until his mental health improves. They'll check back into his case in July. And of course, you can trust Wink News to stay on top of this case for you. Reporting live in downtown Fort Myers, Erin Maloney, Wink News Now. Erin, thank you.